blue crabs, beautiful beaches, spectacular sunsets, the Chincoteague Pony Swim, the list of what makes Delmarva so special goes on and on and on. But there is one tradition that stands out, and rightfully so, because it all centers around a four-legged creature covered in fur. We're not talking about the cuties bed connect because it's not Friday. We're talking about Marshall the Muskrat. <laughs> It is almost time for the Midnight Muskrat Dive in Princess Anne. Here to fill us in on all of the different details is the Tourism Director in Somerset County. This is Julie Wittison. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having and me. And bringing Marshall P. Muskrat. Oh, and you brought cake. I yes, did. yeah. Tell us the story of the cake. Well. What celebration in Somerset County would be complete without Smith Island cake? Well, I mean, right. it's the Maryland's official state dessert. But we do have cake New Year's Eve at Marshall's Shindig. Ooh. Oh, that and, sounds, yeah. well, the so cake alone is, cake is, is reason to go. shucked raw oysters. Oh, my goodness. All sorts of festivities. Well, let's back up a little bit. For those who may not be familiar with it, uh, w explain what is the Midnight Muskrat Dive. It's a mouthful, isn't it? It is. <laughs> <laughs> it's our New Year's celebration. Um, we, we looked around and we wanted to find something that was indicative of the Eastern Shore, mm -hmm. um, but that was unique. And so we decided that for our dive, our drop, it would be a muskrat. So on New Year's Eve, um, we meet downtown Princess Anne in the historic district. Yeah. And uh, along with all sorts of other festivities, Marshall comes down on a zip line <laughs> at midnight. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful, actually, see? Yeah, you it know? is. And yeah. he dresses up for the occasion, he too. He does. Top hat, cape, and all. Now, Marshall is pretty busy this time of year. He is. He's being an ambassador for Princess Anne and greeting people. In fact, yesterday he hung out at Somerset County Visitor Center and greeted visitors to the area. Really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. But, but people really get into this. They really love the whole idea. They do. They do. It's unique. It's, mm -hmm. it's quirky. Um, it's fun. And the event is fantastic. I mean, there's music and food and festivities and dancing in the street and it's very family friendly and it's very affordable most of it's free mm -hmm. um, and uh, so it's the best of a small town celebration it's a street festival right yeah. and, and that's what makes it fun and intimate and so. i'm sorry i think you said how long has somerset county been doing this Princess Anne has been doing this six years, I think. Okay. I've been to all of them. Right. Uh, it's just fantastic, and it's grown. Yeah. Um, last year, I think we had a little over 500 people, and we're expecting more. Oh, my more, goodness, so. really? Yeah. yeah. Well, let's make it bigger. Here are the details for it. Of course, Sunday, December 31st, 9 p.m. to 1 a.m. It's free. It Can't is. Can't beat that. And it's in historic downtown Princess Anne. Thank you so much, Julie, sure. for coming in and bringing Marshall with you. Bring Marshall, your friends and you. family. They'll be dancing in the streets. Dancing in the streets. <laughs> you you got it for more Thanks. than that.